everybody. Welcome to Kitchen Talk with Greta. So glad you guys can come up into the kitchen with me today. I am glad to be back on vacation and able to sit here and talk to you guys for a few minutes. I'm not going to take up too much of your time today, but before we get started, you guys know what the routine is. Go ahead, down at the bottom of your screen, go ahead, hit that thumbs up button. Go ahead and share my video with all your family and friends. And if you have not become a follower of Grandma, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and become one of my followers, okay? All right, so let's go ahead and get it popping up in here today in the kitchen. So today, I am um, just going to keep it real light, just talk to you guys. We're just going to talk, okay? So you guys know I've been on vacation for the last week and a half or so, okay? You know when you go on vacation, especially when you're getting together with family, you just eat, eat, eat. That's all you do the whole time, are just eating and enjoying each other. That's exactly what I did. I have eaten so much in the last week and a half. It's just crazy. So now I gotta get myself back on some type of plan, get back to exercising, and um, just trying to get, get myself together because I know I've gained several pounds since I've been on vacation. And you know when you're on vacation, you wanna be comfortable, so I'm walking around in my leggings all the whole time and not having to worry about putting on no jeans or no shorts or anything like that. And you know how when you haven't wore um, some jeans or some shorts or something, and you try to get them on, you gotta fall on the bed, you try to suck it in and pull them up and you're hopping around and just trying to make it work. And by the time you get them on, you're just tired. <laughs> you're just out of breath and tired so that's where I'm at right now I am just out of breath trying to get dressed trying to put on clothes other than some leggings or some workout pants so I'm sitting up here like okay so now you need to do something about this you need to get yourself back into the routine of working out every day taking your walks every day you need to get back into the routine of not eating the things you know you're not supposed to be eating and you know just trying to get it back under control just trying to get yourself back you know where you feel comfortable within yourself you know um i'm probably gonna start back um uh, as far as eating my vegetables and as far as when it comes to if i eat my proteins what type of proteins i'm eating which is probably just going to be going back to the baked chicken or baked fish or you know something like that and get away from them ribs which i'm not really a beef person but hey you know you're on vacation you just do things that you know you ain't supposed to do so i ate some ribs you know and i ate some um some meats that i shouldn't have been eating so now i just gotta um just gotta work on it and just get it back together and really really get back into drinking um water like i were before I mean, I did drink water on vacation, but not like I usually do, not as much as I usually do. So now I uh, been kind of searching on the uh, Amazon and different stuff, trying to get me a really good waistband. And I've seen one that they've been advertising on uh, Facebook, you know, with the bear crawl that comes across your waist and then it goes down and also hook on to your thighs and stuff. So I was thinking about checking that out. And you know, and then, like I said, just getting my routine back together, getting my schedule back down, you know, walking and doing all those things. I've already had um, gotten away from my regular workout routine, going to the gym and all that. I really miss not being able to get out and go to the gyms. And there are some gyms that has reopened. And the one that I went to, I've had the uh, coaches there to reach out to me. And, you know, trying to get me to come back up in there, but I'm a little bit hesitant because, um, you know, I don't want to, um, I don't want to catch the coronavirus, you know, I don't want to be uh, putting myself in a situation. And I know this gym is a very clean gym. I know that because I, you know, when I was there, even before this coronavirus, how clean they were and everything. And it's a, it is a smaller gym, so it's not as many people. But there were some times in, in the classes that we was having that there would be, you know, quite a few, over 10 people in the class, you know. So that still can be a lot, you know. So I think that I'll give that um, probably another month or so before I venture back out into a gym. I'm going to just continue to try to uh, 
come up with a good workout routine at home. And, uh, you know, I had found some videos where they do the Zoomer, Zoomer classes and different workout classes, dance classes and stuff. So I'm gonna try to get back into that. It's just really hard. I don't know about you guys out there, but it's really hard for me to work out by myself. I'm more of a being part of a group. I do better when I'm in a group setting when it comes to uh, working out, uh, when it comes to the Zuma classes, when it comes to the dance classes. I do better when I'm actually physically there and with the group of people than trying to do it at home, you know, because I don't stay consistent when I'm trying to do it at home on my own. So I just got to figure all that out and get back in there and just make it happen. You know, you can't nobody do it for you. You got to do it yourself. You got to get out there and make it happen. And I'm good. I'm okay when it comes to walking. I don't, I'm, I'm okay with walking by myself and, and doing that. It's just that these last week, and two, week or two, it's, it's been really hot. If you don't get up like extremely early in the morning and go ahead and knock your walk out, then you gotta wait till it's really, really, really late in the evening. You know, you talk about eight o'clock at night before it kind of cools down for you to do that. But, and I know, <laughs> I know you're probably saying, well, all those are just excuses. And yeah, you're right. There are excuses that I'm throwing out there to try to, you know, keep from doing some of this stuff. You know, you have to keep from talking yourself out of doing what you need to do. So right now I gotta get out of that mindset and get myself back under control, you know, uh, making my smoothies in the morning for my breakfast. Or if I do breakfast, then having a smoothie for lunch or something like that. So I definitely got to get, get myself back out there and get myself going and start back uh, being more motivated about wanting to, um, to work out and, and wanting to eat the right things and all that. And just the way my clothes is fitting is, is quite a bit of motivation. It's definitely getting me, you know, to look like, hey, you, you better you better get this under control. You better get it before it get too far out of control. Because, honey, you guys know you, you can easily put that weight on. And you're enjoying family and you're having a good time and you're not even thinking about it. But once all that's gone and you're back to your routine, then you can start trying to, you can you start feeling it. You start seeing it. So that's just something I got to um, I got to work on and, and get better at. You know, I just got to stop coming up with these excuses and just make it happen. So I'm looking forward to doing that. And I'm really, you know, really would be glad when I can get back into the gym and do some things with group, group, act, group exercise, group activities. You know, I used to go bowling every week and I haven't done that. We haven't bowled since March. So that was a good, you know, outing and being around people and, you know, doing the bowling. So I missed that. So now I just got to come up with other ways and stick to it and just make it happen. So, you know, just got to do it. <laughs> I just got to do it. I just, sometimes I just trip myself out. Like I sit up here, get up with, with, with the best intention, you know, hey, this is what I'm going to do today. This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do that. And <laughs> Not a half of the day, I ain't did any of it. And I don't talk myself out of it. So it's just crazy. I just trip myself out sometimes, you know. But I, I just wanted to, you know, just shout at you guys a little bit about that. And I don't know how y'all, you know, been doing with this coronavirus, being locked up. If you came up with any different type of activities that you can do that's, you know, fun and keep you motivated, hey, send them to me. Let me know what they are. Drop them in my in my in my comment section. Let me know what type of uh, activities that you've done to keep yourself. Oh my God, it's a fly in here to keep you guys motivated. You know, let me know some ideals so I can get myself back on board to where I need to be and um, just get myself moving. You, you know, you gotta move. If you as long as you're moving, then you, there's gonna be some type of results. You know, you're gonna get some results. So. Um, that's my plan. That's what I'm planning on doing starting uh, today. Once I get through talking to you guys, you know, that's what that's what my plan is. Is to get make it happen. I'm just gonna make it happen. But that's about it. I really don't have a whole lot to talk to you guys about today. 
just a little something something that was on my mind and a little something something on what I need to do. I know what I need to do, it's just doing it. You know, we all know what we need to do to stay healthy and we know we have to move our bodies to see results. You know, we know we have to eat the right thing. We know we have to drink water. So I just got to do it. You know, I'm gonna go out and pick up some things to make me some smoothie with, you know, give me some stuff to make some green smoothies and different types of fruit um, smoothies, you know, and, and do that and just get myself together. Get to where I won't have to jump around and trying to pull up some jeans or some shorts and laying all on the bed and all that. So I'm just gonna figure that out, get that all together, work that out. But that's about it. That's all I have to, go to bring you guys today. Like I said, if you have any ideas on different types of, um, maybe you got a favorite video or a favorite exercise YouTube that you watch that you think I might enjoy, hey, hit me up, leave me a comment. I definitely check it out and everything. But I'm going to get ready to get on up out of here and get my day going. So, you know, don't forget to go back and give me any, any reviews that you may have or any, any suggestions you may have for, for Grandma. Drop them on me. But, you know, as you go through your day, just, just, you know, be kind to everybody you come in contact with. Enjoy your day. Make sure you're wearing your mask. Coronavirus is still out there. You know, make sure you're practicing your social distance. And just have a great time. Just enjoy. Just get out and enjoy your day, okay? I'm going to get with you guys next time around.